What is servant leadership? What's that all about? Whether you've heard of it or not, how do you do it? Hi, I'm Sam Wilson, the Sam Wilson Home Selling Team at eXp Realty, and I'm the realtor helping realtors with giving back. Welcome to this value stack, video number four in this stack about giving back, and this is about servant leadership. Now, I'm, I'm not gonna get into all the details of servant leadership in a short video here, but this is a huge mastermind topic. Something I do a lot of coaching on, something I've been coached on, and I'm gonna give you the number one guru on this topic, and that's John Maxwell. I won't even suggest one book. Go get all his stuff. Listen to it on Audible. John Maxwell is an absolute leader in servant leadership. Here's what I will tell you in this video. If you want to learn about servant leadership, go volunteer and get yourself to the leadership level. Uh, I'll give you a couple of examples. If you're in an HOA, go get on your board and get to the president level and be the leader. Um, another great one is a networking group, or for me, it was a leads group at the Denver Metro Chamber of Commerce. So let me tell you more about that one. And I've done both that I just recommended. But these are both positions that you don't get paid for. You're a volunteer. If, and John Maxwell taught me this. If you can learn to lead a group that you're just a volunteer in, you're not the boss. They don't have to do what you say. Probably don't want to in a lot of cases. This will cause you to learn what's important to the group you're leading and then serve them so that they'll follow your intention, direction, and leadership. I hope that makes sense. It's a big difference from probably what you're thinking about leadership. There's a big difference between leaders versus managers, which is something I learned at the Coca-Cola company. Um, I think I've mentioned before, I was there for 14 years, got to some high level leadership positions, and it was 100% because of leading, not managing, okay? Managers push you through a brick wall. Leaders make you wanna come running through it to get to the other side with you. That's what I'm talking about, servant leadership. It's so important when it comes to giving back and you have to set the example. You have to be the example every day. So first be, then do, then say. So go study some of this servant leadership stuff. I think it'll really help you with giving back to your team, to your clients, to your community um, and supporting your why. So I look forward to seeing you over in video number uh, five on this uh, value stack about giving back. And this is about being a team leader on your team and why your team is your client. I'm Sam Wilson, the Sam Wilson Home Selling Team at eXp Realty, and I'm the realtor helping realtors in this value stack about giving back. I'll see you over there in that next video.